Hey, what's going on guys? This is Justin with wingsound.com. In this video, I'll show you an editing quick tip to avoid clicks and pops when working with audio. I'm using Pro Tools 8, but you can use this in any software that you guys use. So let's check it out. Okay, so let's say you work with loops and samples, you know, arranging them in your edit window. As you can see there, a bunch of different audio samples put together. And what might happen is when you start chopping things up, you know, you might get some clicks and pops and weird noises going on. And obviously you don't want that. You want to clean up your audio. So I'll play these two loops that I have here and listen real closely for the click. So you don't want that, obviously. So what you want to do is work in grid mode with the smart tool and you want to change your grid note value to either 132nd or 164th note so you can get some real precise editing work done there. So I'm going to zoom in now a little bit with T I'm using to zoom in and that's if the keyboard focus the AZ is on. You can use T and R to zoom in and out. Okay, so I'm going to try to listen to see where that click comes in if it's the end of the first region or the beginning of the second. Sounds to me like it's the beginning of the second. So I'm going to zoom in more. And I'm going to go to the top corner of that second region and just draw in a little fade. All right, so let's hear this now. It's still there a little bit, but getting there. So you could either go in and adjust that fade a little longer. So let's hear this now. So it's pretty clean. You know, you got rid of that little click. Or another thing you could do is draw a little fade at the end of the first region. Let's hear this now. You know, it works, it cleans it up, but you can hear the sound drops out a little bit. So I'm gonna take out that and just leave this fade in the beginning. So it's really easy, you know, you could really clean up your audio this way. And then if you start to work with, you know, how this is with these, all these little regions arranged, as you can see, I've drawn already a few fades in there, so it cleans it up. So let's just play this kick track right here. So you can hear like, these shorter regions right here you hear little like you know little clicks at the end of them so again just zoom in and then you know put in a little fade so let's hear it now And there you go, cleaned it up, really simple. You know, maybe draw in over here just to clean these up a little bit. And you don't get those weird noises going on. 